Howdy viewers, Brad Pryder of Barstool Entertainment continuing on with some Red Dead Redemption 2 videos. The O'Driscolls are an enemy gang and they have been quite a presence in Arthur's adventures throughout Red Dead Redemption 2. I posted a video where he ambushes a camp of O'Driscolls and this time, Arthur is breaking a roadblock that the O'Driscolls have established to try and fleece people out of money or just steal from them. So let's get on with this wonderful video. While riding toward Valentine, Arthur came upon this roadblock set up by the O'Driscolls. Rather than confront them directly, he backed off, and now he's going to fight back. God damn it! I'm going to fast forward through the looting of the O'Driscolls and Arthur calling his horse. The wagon has obviously disappeared. Now the wagon has disappeared and I figured, okay, I didn't get a chance to steal it. But as I was riding off, oh wait, what's this? A wagon. And I can steal this and take it to a fence. In um, what is it, Emerald um, Ranch or whatever the heck it is. Yeah, this is going to be fun. Depending on the type of wagon you bring to the guy, yeah, you can actually make some decent money. This looks like a good wagon, and it looks like it could net some good money. So, I'm going to bring it to the fence. Naturally, I'm just going to fast forward through the drive to Emerald Ranch. While stealing a wagon, whistle to get your horse to follow you. Otherwise, it's just going to stand there and you're out of horse. Find a good home for this. Here you go. See you again soon. Forty dollars from Seamus. And now once he gets back to his main shop, I can then sell off the crap I stole from the O'Driscolls. And this is funny. Watch this. He jumps up, stands there. And then he just drops down. And now I can sell stuff to Seamus that I stole from the, or borrowed from the O'Driscolls and make some extra money. If you found this video 
informative and you like it, hit the thumbs up button. Feel free to leave a comment. If you like this type of video, hit the subscribe button and bell icon because I post four videos involving video games a week, as well as a short and potentially surprise videos, and you don't want to miss out. As always, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and most of all, thanks for stopping by.